the James Webb Telescope has taken a new photo of the center of the Milky Way. The new image reveals unprecedented detail of this region marked by a star-forming area just 300 light-years from Sagittarius A, our galaxy's supermassive black hole. The details of the heart of our galaxy have been revealed through gas and dust, thanks to near-infrared camera technology, producing unprecedented images of great scientific value. This region contains more than 500,000 stars and several clusters of protostars that are still forming and gaining mass. The center of the galaxy is the most extreme environment in it, explained University of Virginia professor Jonathan Tan. Until now, astronomers have not imaged this area in such detail and resolution. Explaining how it is possible for stars to be born in such a troubled environment due to the turbulent last gasps of dying stars remains a mystery. Samuel Crow, principal investigator of the observing team at the UVA in Charlottesville, said, There has never been any infrared data in this region with the level of resolution and sensitivity that we got with Webb. The immense area shown in this recent JWST image is about 50 light-years from end to end and is located approximately 25,000 light-years from Earth. According to NASA, the galactic center is close enough to study individual stars with the Webb telescope. At the center of this region is a massive protostar with a mass of 30 solar masses, it blocks the light behind it, making its surroundings appear less crowded. NIRCAM also recorded a large-scale emission of ionized hydrogen, this is the blue area at the bottom of the image. This effect likely occurs because young, massive stars emit high-energy photons, but the size of this region was a surprise to scientists. Located about 25,000 light-years from us, the center of the Milky Way is a region where stars are formed at full speed, hence the interest of astronomers to study the region. The galactic center is the most extreme environment in the Milky Way where current theories of star formation can pass the most rigorous tests, said Jonathan Tan, one of Crow's supervisors. Because of the short distance, in astronomical terms, astronomers can use Webb to individually study the stars at the center. In this way, they can understand how they form and how they affect the environment relative to other regions in the Milky Way. Once again, the photos taken by the James Webb Telescope are fascinating and fundamental to the advancement of our knowledge of our galaxy. And if you want to continue receiving news about the scientific discoveries made by Webb and about our universe, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, and to leave a like, if you enjoyed this video. That's it for now, see you soon, and keep thinking.